we're going to talk about Leos. Leo is represented by the lion. If you were born between July 23rd and August 22nd, then you are a Leo. Got my four locals. So Leo is a fire sign. They denote action and power. And their planet is the sun. Leos are known for their strong hearts and their strong backbones. They love being the center of attention. I'm surprised I'm not a Leo. They usually have like a posse or a following. They have admirers. Admirers. Because Leos are true born leaders. They have followers that believe what they believe, that think the way they do. And the reason that it works so well is because loyalty is everything for Leos. It goes both ways. Loyal Leos. Loyal Leos are really great, awesome friends because they're loyal. You can trust them, you can depend on them, they are there for you, and they expect the same from you. And nothing less. Now, Leo women. Bum, ba, da, bum. Leo women know how to be blunt. They are super honest. They know how to express how they feel and you always know like where you're at and where you stand with a Leo woman. She's not fake or phony. Yes, she can be a drama queen and she can be very dramatic, but she is kind of one of the most real people you will ever meet. It's weird though because they're very good at like acting, but at the same time they're really good friends. However, sometimes they'll do things they don't want to do just because they're loyal, but it doesn't necessarily mean that their heart's in it all the way, if that makes any sense. Leo women like get along with everyone, basically. I'm sure they have their pitfalls and stuff, but they draw in a crowd, you know? Like, they're the kind of people that you remember when you meet them. They don't just pass you by, they stay with you. Leo women love romance, they love flattery, they love to be admired. They can be really old fashioned when it comes to romance and the feelings, they like to be courted. And when a Leo woman loves you, she loves you with all she has. She really, really loves you, it's not just like halfway. Leo women always seem to have it together, even when they don't have it together, really. They exude confidence. They always do best in positions of leadership at work, and they would rather work at home at their own business than have to like listen to other people tell them what to do at work. So it's not that they necessarily have problems with authority, it's more like that's just not what's suited for them, it's not what's best for them, and it's not their place, and they know it. If she doesn't respect something that you say or do, she will call you out for it. She won't be the passive aggressive thing. In fact, she's probably one of the least passive aggressive people you'll ever meet. She's not the kind of person that's gonna become a stay at home mom. And if she is a mom, she's always doing more than just being a mom. Like, yes, being a mom is like a really hard job, but she'll like multitask. Her career is not first, but it's very important to her. She'll probably have her own business if she's at home. She won't be content or satisfied just being a mom. And if she's not a mom, she's really good with kids. Leos are really good with kids. So they might even find themselves working in a profession that requires them to be with kids. Leos are very adaptable to different situations. They're very versatile. Leos believe in making a good impression. They are actresses. They are going to be the ones that you remember the most. And as far as like dressing to impress, they care about looking nice. They care about the nice things. They want to make sure that everything is top notch for them because that's what they deserve. They're loyal to a fault. And they definitely express themselves outwardly and also in their clothing. They tend to dress more colorfully or more boldly and they like making a statement. When it comes to the Leo man, 
They do not like being told what to do. They love being in charge and they love taking control of situations and they're very adaptable and very good at it. The Leo man usually has a close-knit group of friends. So if you're dating someone who's a Leo, then you'll have to also be like, get used to the fact that you're dating his friends as well. They kind of come with the package of him, so just be aware that if you're insecure, things are not going to work out and that you kind of have to be okay with the whole package and the whole deal that whatever you get with your Leo man. But you need to trust that he is committed to you and that he's there with you, not with the other people in his posse. Leos are actually like the least likely to cheat unless they feel like your loyalty is being questioned. Loyalty is everything to them. Trust is everything to them. So make sure that you honor that. Most people really like the way the Leo man communicates. It's very straightforward, very direct, and he'll say what he wants. He'll say what he needs, and people are drawn to that. They are attracted to his bluntness. He's easy to get along with. He doesn't, he might have special opinions about things, but it doesn't mean he's a hateful person. He's outgoing, he's compassionate and kind, and he's a leader at heart. He just like oozes that leadership, the confidence, it just is everywhere around him. He is a kid at heart, but that also means that kids tend to love him. Anyway, yes, so, are you a Leo? Let me know what you think of all this, or if this was helpful to you. I hope to see you soon. Subscribe to my channel. Bye!